What's up, my guy? Well, hello there and good morning. And uh, I want to say my personal experience with Kang has been satisfactory and I'm pleased with myself for the performance that I've had with him. I think I was at 126 yesterday. Um, I'm at 128 now. I did get to 129. I've had good results with the decks that I've played. It feels fine. Last night I was running Shuri Zero and I was able to net seven cubes in nine games, 0.7 uh, average cubes. What do I got my cat cat thing over there? Um, <clears throat> This kind of worries me though. No, listen. So there's a lot of metrics. There's, there's, King, percent of decks seen, not very many. Win percentage, 53% would be a better number. Average cubes, 0.3 would be a better number. Win drawn, under 50%, that 53% would be a better number. Average cubes, 0.3 would be a better number. Win played, he is the worst card. Over 200 cards in this game. And Kang has the worst cube rate of all the cards in Marvel Snap. Not 150th, not 125th, the worst, the worst card. So I don't know. Yeah, so I don't know. Um, I don't have a good explanation for this because my experience is a little different and I don't know how to put... So there's numbers, right? And there's numbers and there's numbers and there's numbers and numbers. And trying to figure out what the numbers mean is a secondary thing and it's subjective. And I'm not sure what to make of this. Maybe it's too early to tell. I mean, what has it been? Um, let's see, uh, King has been out for not quite 48 hours, but we're coming up on two days. Maybe the data's behind. Maybe bad players are playing King. Maybe we don't know how to play King correctly yet. Maybe King or maybe people are putting King in decks in every deck. And they're not putting him in decks that he's good in. I think he's pretty good in the Galactus deck, actually. I, he make to me he makes a lot of sense in Galactus. Yeah, it feels like a good card to me. All right, so I'm gonna, I, I first of all, um, when I made, uh, a couple days ago before Kane came out, I said something is like, I wanna play him for a week. All right, but I, I, I was scrolling through YouTube this morning before I started my stream and I saw someone with a title, like 80% win rate, how? Where, who's got an eighty percent win rate with King? I, I can't. That can't be true. It kind of annoyed me a little bit. I didn't watch the video, so I, I don't know if he had a better explanation or if he said sorry for clickbaiting the fuck out of you. I'm all either I'm either a liar and hate my audience, or I'm a bad player. Either way, it looks bad. I'm sorry. Um. I think the stats because you retreat when you usually play him. I think that's it, bruh. Actually, I do think that's what it is. I think it's because you play him and then you typically retreat. So uh, I want to revisit this idea for a couple days. But what I'm suggesting is that... We 
What if you put a rock in your deck? Just a rock. The rock is not helping you win. So King is not helping you do anything other than give you more information. There's a situation where if you play him on the turn that you draw him, like on turn five or turn six, then he's a cantrip, right? Which only happens under normal circumstances in about 22% of the games. Like, I'm okay with that. But the fact that he is doing nothing to put points on the board, is that making the stats bad and we're just not really acknowledging that? I don't know. Yeah, I, I don't know what to make of these stats. I, I really, I really want to, I just want to process this and sit back and, and play him some more. I personally have climbed from 126 up to 129. Now I'm at 128. So I, I, I want to play him some more. I want to... I want to do it. I want to keep going. I I I, I want to. I still think he's a, a decent card, but I'm not. I'm not like. I'm not willing to like say King is the best card in the game. Put him in every deck. Eighty percent win rate. I have no idea where, where people are getting this idea. Um, you know, he's good. He's definitely interesting. I think he's helping me win games. Yeah, I, maybe maybe we're not playing him right yet. Anyways, last night I was playing this deck. And this is a known uh, a Galactus deck. And um, I was skeptical. Someone mentioned this in chat the other day. And um, Yellow Jacket, Adam Warlock. And it works in about one in five games. The, Adam, the, the Yellow Jacket, Adam Warlock thing. Uh, I chatted yesterday with like a, a super Galactus player and even he said, yeah, I don't know about the Yellow Jacket, Adam Warlock thing. He was saying, I think you're better off just putting Maximus in your deck uh, is what he told me. But I, I did like this build. Um, it, this build also is a little different than the one we were playing yesterday because it also includes Spider-Man. So we're going to try. I, and I feel like, I feel like with my experience with playing Kang, Kang, this feels like the right kind of deck to play Kang. You know, a deck where you don't always get your Galactus draw. Kang sometimes helps you bluff your way out of those situations and so on. Quicksilver Warlock is better? Maybe. That does sound right. Let's try this, though. That, that that's that's possible. Okay, yeah, what you just said makes sense to me, Steve. Uh that that is what I suspect what you just said. All right, so we have King in our opening hand. I played Yellow Jacket first because it's an on-reveal ability. Just going to fill up the space. Now, if I had... If this location is open, I believe I should snap. Uh, you know, the, the win conditions for uh, the Galactus deck. Sinister London. All right. We're going to do Electro. Electro here... And, um, hmm. Is that enough to win the game? I think so. I think I want to snap here. I want to be more, a little bit more aggressive on my snapping with Galactus because the cube equity is kind of low anyways. So I feel like I, like when I have like a combo, Electro Galactus, you know, I've got death, win condition. I've got King to... Help me out a little bit, you know. So like I've I've got a I've got a reasonable oh like I got null, even better, right? Uh I'm gonna do nothing here. I'm just gonna pass.
All right, I'm going to play Kang before Galactus, just to see if they have a tricky arrow play or something like that. All right, that's fine. Let's go. I mean, if he if they've got a, a tricky... I mean, I could lose four cubes right here. I mean, as long as I have priority, I guess it doesn't matter. All right, what do we got? Shuri. All right, do I have priority? No, they have priority. I'm gonna play king here just to see if they're gonna if they have an arrow play or not. All right, let's see what we got. Quicksilver, Quicksilver, Adam Warlock sounds super interesting to me. By the way, I might want to try that later. I don't know if I'll try that today, but I, that, that sounds super interesting to me. All right, let's see what they do here. Let's see if this uh, king pays off right here. Like, if they've got arrow, I could be screwed, right? And this will let me know if they have arrow or not. Let's see if we let's see if you got arrow, my guy. Play your card. Oh my god! What are you doing? 5D chess? Let's fist bump him. Alright, let's... Titania. Alright. Alright. Alright, we're gonna... We're gonna play Galactus now. All right, so does 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 Galactus not work with that? Yeah, it works. Holy moly, dude. All right, let's see what he got. Oh my god. Did we just get juked? We got juked. Oh my God, we got juked. Wow, this guy's, I, I gotta give him props actually. My God, my God. Oh, come on, fist bump. Wow. Wow. King backfired on us. Four cube loss. I don't think I... I, I, I feel like ever since I changed my name to Moliza, I don't get stream snipers. I really don't think I get stream snipers anymore. Yeah, yeah, that, that's fine. All right, let's do Yellow Jacket into Adam Warlock. Let's see how it goes. They took a long time to first play. Um, For what it's worth, I play a lot better offline. Like, I maybe that's, I, I mean, maybe it's because I'm focused or something. I don't know. I'm gonna play, should I play wave here? I don't know, let's see. Hmm. I think it was a good play. Yeah, I mean, I, I, you know, it is what it is, right? Oh, man, we're just not getting any value out of Adam Warlock right there. All right, well, let's do... Um,
Um, I'm gonna YOLO this right here. And we lose to Shang-Chi. Well, let's see. Yeah, we... Oh, yeah. Okay, they... Ooh, Seth, great idea. Actually, that's a pretty excellent suggestion right there. Use Adam and Nail Jack, mostly the right lane, mostly the left mid are usually lanes people go for first. Yeah, I, Galactus deck is uh, location sensitive also. I mean, you just, like, you, it's always horrible placing things into the wrong location. I have Absorbing Man, the token shot, I'm waiting on She Hulk. Is She Hulk more viable? Yes. Absorbing Man is not, not bad at all but i think she hulk is more flexible but my absorbing man got a lot of play but that the absorbing man was largely a function of i'm not gonna play this absorbing man was largely a function of zabu when i played absorbing man a lot absorbing man still i mean serving man is kind of like like Mystique, it just gets used a lot, right? Mystique gets used a lot, Absorbing Man gets used a lot, but I don't use Absorbing Man nearly as much since the Zabu nerf. Like, way less. Way, way less. You just hit 3,000 power? Congratulations, Joel. How many cards are you away from pool three complete? All right, well, I'm going to try... Whoa, 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 wait. Did I not play Adam Warlock last turn? Well, let's try it over here, I guess. Mm. No, we definitely want to play into Mojo World because... Yeah. Mojo World's garbage, man, for this deck. I'm not sure. Uh, if I do Quicksilver, it'll be tomorrow. I, I want to. I like to test my decks before I play on stream. Usually. All right, we got a card draw out of it. Nice, 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 nice. All right, so we're gonna get. Doc Ock here in a minute. Lizard, Ebony Ma. All right, Electro. Should I Doc? Oh, let's see how many cards he has in his hand first. He has two. We really need to draw into. We really need to draw into. Galactus here. Um, which basically, you know, right now I could have a one in four chance of drawing Galactus, but I also have a one in four chance in drawing King. If I draw King, then it's a cantrip. All right, let's see. We've got there two cards in their hand getting yanked in here. Doom. Okay. And arrow. Okay, good. All right, there's Galactus, right? So we're going to snap. What do they have? I can't understand what they have. What do they have that's going to ruin me? Maybe they have king. They have king? No, they have wave. All right. Cosmo would have ruined me too. Yes. What's up, Joel? Thank you for the $2 super chat. All right. I mean, they could draw into Taskmaster. I don't really care. I, I They're going to retreat. All right. Four cubes. All right. No king needed for that victory.
cards that cost one, two, or three can't be played here. All right, well, let's just go into the middle, I guess. Oh, um, oh, that's a good question. Do you know what's kind of terrible is that there is no uh, way of knowing if you're pull three complete. Um, I, I will show you, I can show you how to see what cards you're missing. And then you would have to just know, that's kind of terrible. You would just have to know, oh, I don't want to do it. All right, let me show you. Why wow, there's some early snaps today. Oh yeah, you can use it. If you're on Android, you could use a tracker app. Um, but if you're not on Android or Steam client, then the way that I would check is go in here and turn off variants, then hit unowned, and then sort by quality. And then you will see what cards you are missing. Dazzler, Ghost, Mbaku, Sentry, Shadow King, Shanna, and Stature. Now, all of those cards are four or five. Just because I know that, right? But if you're not sure, then you can't, if you know, if you see that you're missing, um, you know, you can't, then you have to manually check on a website which cards are pool three or not. The other way of doing it is if you have an Android device, I believe, let's see, does this work? Progress. Yeah, so this is the Marvel Snap dot Pro Marvel Snap dot Pro app, which is connected to my Steam client. It is not connected to uh, iOS, and I've I've only I've only connected it, but it shows that I have Pool Three, and I am eighty four out of eighty four. I'm one hundred percent. I'm Pool Three complete. Yeah, well, yeah, if you've ever pulled a more than 100, yeah, that's a good way of knowing, too. If you ever pulled, like, 200 or whatever. All right, let's keep going. You pulled Dazzler this morning? Someone was trying to tell me that Dazzler was good yesterday in an Ultron deck. I haven't seen it. Hmm. We could be in a pickle here. Let's see what this third location is. Jeff, playing Green Goblin in a bar sinister is one of my favorite things, and things to do in the entire world. I love doing it. Sixty nine, sixty nine percent pull three complete. So how many cards? Yeah. So you've got like, what twenty cards left to do? Maybe fifteen cards left to do. It's gonna be a minute. Which you're getting like one every three days or something. Oh, baby shark. You yeah, have Jeff the land shark. That's an interesting card. Mystique. Oh, we got double Zabu. All right. All right. Let's yank some cards right here. Yeah, I, it doesn't matter. Fifty-eight out of eighty-four. There you go. There you go.
Yeah, there's a Jameson card in the data mines that gives you more emotes. We're going to go over that. I saw it on Reddit this morning. Yeah, there's there. He, basically, he has like ruder emotes and he says funny things. Korg. Shanxi, yikes. Quinjet, yikes. Sarah, yikes. He has one card in his hand. But does he know about Galactus, gang? Let's see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 16 power null? Oh, is that going to be enough? Moon Girl. Twenty two, twenty five, twenty seven power null should be enough. Let's see if I can draw into King here. Maybe King. All right, we're gonna play King just to see if. Um, actually, it doesn't matter. Why? Why would I do this? Why would I do? I mean, should I just play King and snap, and just see what he does? Yo, ten from the Doc Ock. You thank you, Corey. Yeah, you're hundred percent right. See, I feel like this is a waste. I should have just played Null. Oh, maybe I can draw Death. Yeah, there you go. So I've got a 1 in 3 chance of drawing Death here. Yeah, I'll get another draw. They may retreat. But here's the thing. If they're going to retreat, they're going to retreat, right? I'm just thinking about, like... Let's say they do accept this, uh, that I missed out on three cubes. If, if, like, they don't know if I have null. Yeah, see, I don't know. The snap mics. All right, see, like, I could have got four cubes. Okay, so they got Dark Hawk. So now are they more scared? See, I feel like I, I, I didn't, I didn't do it right. Like, I, tw I should have just played null and got the four cubes. <sighs> I should have just got null and got the four cubes, right? If they don't play this out, then then I wasted three cubes. Oh, you just wasted three cubes? No, they played it off. All right. All right, so it did not cost me cubes. All right, cool. All right, let's see. My missions, what do I got? Two hours? Okay. Yeah, I don't know that I want to play. I, I mean, I guess, I guess playing him there was fine, but what if he retreated after that? You know what I mean? And then I'd be like, well, I just wasted cubes. Hmm. What do I want to do here? This kind of is a uh, miniature electro, right? So I might as well throw out Sunspot. I don't know. So what this is Cerebro 3. We're playing against Cerebro 3 here. We got to be mindful of what, Valkyrie? Okay. Hmm. This is Cerebro 3. I don't have a win condition in my hand. Probably would have wasted two cubes if you treated, not three. Okay, I agree. 
I agree. I agree, Steven. I agree. I, I get what you say. I get what you mean by that. Yeah, maybe the trackers are off. That's the other thing. Maybe the trackers are not tracking Kane correctly. Yeah, I don't know. I, 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 I'm going, I, I, I feel like it's too soon to tell on Kang. For me, he feels like he is helping this deck. But what it, what would I be playing instead of Kang on this deck list? Cloak? Chavez? Yeah, I would be playing Chavez instead of Kang. Oh. There, there's a debate right there, right? Uh, I have not seen the new animations. I would like to see that. Which, who, whose Twitter did they, uh, do that on? It's on their own Twitter? All right. Oof. Victory. Let's take a look at it. I did look at Twitter this morning for a little bit. Let's see, search Twitter. Um, Marvel Snap. This is the Marvel Snap official Twitter. You said that they put the the Thanos animations here. Are links allowed in chat? Um, yeah, the post on February 22nd. Oh, this. Oh, I like that. That's faster. All right. All right, I like that. No, I have not seen that. That's actually pretty cool. Ooh. 
Why I've already got him to um I've already got him to that um this uh the this border. So I've played him a little bit. I know, right? Do you, do you think that they could just put like a little icon on the Thanos card or something that shows like the dots, like just have like five dots, six dots, whatever. Oh, the animation was the in the animation was terrible. The the animation um that they just was time consuming and ugly. This is fast and attractive or more attractive. All right, let's see if we draw into Electra right here. Yeah, wave, wave. I mean, oh, I, I mean, I can uh, Galactus in, I, I can turn for Galactus. Yeah, let's do it. Mr. Negative? Oh, oh, that's bad for me. Oh, that's bad for me. Oh, man, that is so bad for me. Oh, we lose. We just outright lose. Didn't think about that. Hmm. That was a complete just misplay on my part. Complete brain fart. Let's play it out a little longer. We just gave away two cubes there because I wasn't thinking. Didn't think about Oscorp Tower working at my disadvantage on a Kang deck. Should have played Wave here and then Galactus there. All right, let's see if we can screw up their Wong play here. I'm not sure. Uh, I was playing Cloak yesterday, and Cloak is is good on that Central Park or whatever that Squirrel location. But yeah, now they have nothing. I wish I would have uh, drawn the king. Like right now would be a perfect situation for king, right? Uh, we're going to retreat because of um, Mr. Negative. Like they have an inverted hand. They've got three cards in their hand. At least one of them is inverted, if not two. One of them for sure. Yeah, I don't think this is a W. They may, they may retreat though also. Uh, the best Shuri deck is gonna be, a, I'll show you the best Shuri deck. You do, I, I, oh, that's kind of nice. Dude, I'm mo I'm finishing off these cards. That's kind of why I'm playing these cards right now is I wanted to finish these cards off. I've got this weird thing where I want to get all of them to the rainbow border. Quick silver boosters, that helps. All right, so I'm guessing you're asking for a non-Sauron build because not everybody has Sauron, and I don't think Sauron is where it's sure he's zero. Um, I don't want to do that. Shuri zero. And there's a couple cards that are 100% needed for this, and there's a couple cards that are optional. All right, Sunspot Zero. You can use Ebony Mar or Titania. I really think you need Armo. I think you really need Lizard. You really need Shuri. Don't need Kang. You could put Typhoid Mary or Cosmo in place of Kang. Gotta have Taskmaster, gotta have Arrow, gotta have Red Skull, gotta have She-Hulk. Arnim Zola can be substituted. I think, I feel like Arnim Zola, Kang, and Titania can be substituted for Ebony Maw which is risky. I think is better than Ebony Ma. Cosmo, Typhoid Mary, uh, and such. Cards that I would not replace on this list, Shuri, Taskmaster, Arrow, Red Skull, She-Hulk. 
Shuri, Taskmaster, Arrow, Red Skull, She-Hulk are kind of the core of the deck and Sunspot, I guess. Uh, the Zero, Titania, Armor, Lizard, they just help you get priority. This deck really wants to have priority. Yeah, this deck really wants to have priority. So whatever you feel is going to be like your your early game, you know, the first three turns, whatever you need to do to get priority in those three turns it is important. Yeah, armor is great. Yeah, you need to have Cosmo. Cosmo helps also. Armor and Cosmo. Everything but King. King is not... King, I just threw him in there. In fact, I believe the that I removed... Uh, I removed Typhoid Mary. King, I just put there to try it out. But I think yesterday I had Typhoid Mary here. And you could do Cosmo. Cosmo or Typhoid Mary instead of King. Um, this deck runs Arnim Zola, so maybe Cosmo's not the best. Um, but, uh, do whatever you gotta do. Typhoid Mary, I think, is the, the build. The, the build with Typhoid Mary here is pretty good. Which is Big Bag Matter? I think Thanos is the best still. I believe, in my opinion, I believe Thanos is the best. Thanos Lockjaw is probably the strongest deck in the game right now, next to Shuri Zero. Destroy all cards here. Okay, well, we can do that with um, Electro. Yeah, I think right, everything changes. Everything is fluid in this game and the meta shifts. Right now, Thanos is the best. That may be different next week. Oh, what do I want to do here? No, I got to do that. I got to do that. Oh, please don't have armor. Oh, my God. Oh, do I care about this collapsed mine? Not really. Oh, that doesn't work, does it? Hmm. All right, I guess we skip. This is a, maybe a misplay. All right, well. YOLO! Oh, I forgot about her. That's the second time I've lost to that today. I completely forgot about that. Is it the same guy? Oh, yeah, I think it's the same guy, too. That could work, right? Yeah, we're in a bail. That's the second time I've gotten... So this is this is the learning curve to a new deck. This is a new deck for me. Yeah, the Titania thing, man. The last three days I got Shuri Air Magneto. Holy shit, dude. Which shows Shuri's Air Shuri getting nerfed. Apologies to the community. Oh. Yeah, those are all great cards. Read three tomorrow. Uh, I know Cat really wants to. She really likes, uh, what's his name, Jordan. She's a big fan. Uh, this messes me up. Ugh. 
I need to turn for Galactus or turn for Doc Ock and it's not going to happen. Yeah, I mean, well, I mean, would would any is anybody going to care if they you know, you know Arrow used to be a a 56 and they made her a 58 now she's a 57. Is anybody going to care if if she's a Does anybody care if she's a uh a, a 56? Is that even a thing? Yeah, I don't think anybody cares. Oh, I can't do that. Every adult woman is a big fan of Michael B. Jordan. Uh, yeah, she is. And and that's fine. She she loves him. She loves Tom Hardy. She really likes Tom Hardy. This is true. Um, what is this guy doing? Do we lose to Arrow right here? No, we lose to Wave. All right, Wave is fine. All right, we're gonna play King here. Dirty Galactus player, I know, right? I'm a dirty Galactus player. I'm actually, what is wrong with me in wanting to get every card in my collection collection to the, the, the purple infinite border? Something's wrong with me, man. Like it actually, like I want them all to be the same color. Oh, and look, see, look at the, look at this. This is something satisfying to me to see all these cards with the same kind of border, not mismatched. And then it's like, ah, oh, these guys are, Scum. They need to go up. Forces me to play cards I don't really want to play. And that's why I've, I'm... I, like, in general, I'm not a, a Galactus player. In general. But this deck has... Which is highly satisfying to me. You know, four cards that I do not have at the border. Yellow Jacket. Well, Adam Warlock. I just did. Uh, King I'm working on, Null I'm working on, Null will be there soon. And then I also have a, when I get to 155, I can enable this variant. I just become a dirty Thanos player via the token shop. Hey man, Thanos, like, in tournaments, uh, right now in tournaments, uh, Thanos Lockjaw decks are winning tournaments, which is a different format than ranked. You can get away with Galactus. You can get away with Shuri Zero in rank, but tournaments are different because your opponent, you're playing the same opponent several times. And um, because you're playing, I don't need to play that now. Because you're playing the same opponent over and over again. Um, the, the, you know, I think there's hard counters to those decks. And so Thanos Lockjaw is, is one of the strongest decks in the game in that tournament mode. And I think it's this, one of the strongest decks in this format, la the ladder mode. All right, let's see here. Let's put in... It, Thanos is not an auto player deck. Yes, Thanos actually requires 
Like, I don't, I'm not probably that good of a Thanos player. I did play a lot of Thanos um, when that location was, so I kind of have an idea. But using Time Stone and Space Stone and Reality Stone at the correct times are kind of a big deal. The deck is mostly about Quinjet and Lockjaw and the stones. Would I purchase Galactus or King first? And you have Shuri and you have Thanos or you just don't like those cards. YOLO. I don't know. Yeah, you already own Thanos and Shuri. All right. Um, all right. You either like Galactus decks or you don't. There, there's something to be said about experiencing playing a Galactus deck. Like, the benefit to playing a Galactus deck is that you actually... Like, what I learned today is Titania can destroy Galactus decks. And now I know how to use Titania to ruin a Galactus Days player. Like, how would I have learned that unless I played Galactus, right? I'm going to play this. I think I'm going to lose, but I'm going to play this. I think I'm going to lose to Cosmo or Arrow right here. Titania, yeah. Arrow, leech. Huh. That's kind of bad. Hopefully I draw into King and get a free snap, right? Hmm. They have seven cards in their hand. I don't know, ma'am. <clears throat> oh, my gut feeling on this, the Galactus versus King question is, I would watch streams and YouTube for like a week and see how this King thing plays out with the idea that you want to buy King, but you want to see how it plays out. I believe King is going to be more flexible of a card long-term than Galactus. Uh, Galactus also might be getting better with Nimrod and this idea of a turn six Galactus deck, you know, running like Shuri and everything might be a thing um, a week from now. Galactus might get a lot better with Nimrod. Yeah, one is an archetype, one is a tech card. That is a thousand percent accurate. Let's see what's drop you in there. Nimrod do he's kind of got like a doom a doom kind of feel when he dies. He's a 5-5, five, five, but when he dies, you place two of them in each location, one in each location. All right, let's do this. Mm, I should snap here. Where do I want to go crazy? Here? Or here? Doc Ock on mid? I don't want to suck as many cards out of his hand as possible. He's got four cards in his hand. Isn't this going to suck a bunch of cards out of his hand? It's a 5-5. Five, five.
Doom, 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 doom. Give me those cubes. Victory. Oh, Thanos Lockjaw deck. All right, let me show you. I, I, you can take out Kang and you could add in there's a couple variations to Thanos Lockjaw that are good. Let's see, I hate that. It drives me insane. Um, you can use... There's a couple cards that are interchangeable in here. King can be Wave. King can be Wave. King can be America Chavez. And then some of these other cards are interchangeable too, like Magneto and Devil Dino with like Hulk or whatever you want to use. I do think you want to play Sunspot, Quinjet, Lockjaw, Shang-Chi, Blue Marvel, Leech, Arrow, She-Hulk, Thanos. You know, but then you then you know in this slot here or this slot here or this slot here, you could insert Wave, Chavez, or Hulk. Correct. Yeah, what Liam said is a hundred percent accurate. Yeah. 100% accurate. Yeah, try it out. Yeah, I don't know what's gonna... There's this whole idea of a turn six Galactus deck running Shuri and Nimrod and Wolverine. Might be hard to pull off. I mean, I, I'm sure it's going to have ramp in it, like Electro and Wave, but it's also going to have a, an alternate win condition. What do I want to do here? Is this, is this, um, is this a, hold on. I need to look at this. Wait a minute. So I can't play here because of Goose. Turn six were locked out. What do I do wave into Galactus into Doc Ock? Well, that sounds bad. Oh, I can't win this. I can't win this, can I? Goose has really screwed me up. All right. Wave Galactus Spidey. Oh, shoot. Well, that wouldn't have mattered anyways, right? No, Wave Galactus Spidey? Because you, there, nobody can play cards on turn six anyways. Do you think seven power would win? Yeah, if this wasn't the vault, I think that would work. Yeah, the vault is going to... Wave Galactus Spider-Man on non-vault would be good, but the goose screwed me up. I, I think you're right on the line, because then I could have done Galactus... Normally, I could have gone Wave Galactus Spider-Man Null or whatever and won, but vault screwed me up. I'm glad that I retreated. Mm-mm. <laughs> 
T6 Doom into Bar Sinister. Nice. Breaking news. She Hulk. Such a great card. All right, we're going to do nothing. We don't have any ramp in my hand. Random card. What, what, what is all these extra cards? I need to. I need to get rid of these cards. All right, let's let's do it. Let's get rid of these because I don't want to get stuck with them. Not be able to draw something. One, two, three, four, five, six. All right. I guess I didn't need to do both, but it doesn't matter. We need ramp. Mm. All right, we got our little ramp. So. What I need to draw into probably is Doc Ock would be pretty useful right now. Mysterio, that doesn't help what I want to do. Oh, there he is. I'm going to snap. Let's see what's YOLO it. All right. Getting to rank 90 with Zudex? Oh my god. With Painful Process? Yes, you can do it. You can do it. It sounds painful, man. I feel like Zoo is... Was... Is... For sure the best deck in pool 2. All right, so I've got Galactus. If I can get Spider-Man, Spider-Man would be okay. I don't need to play that. Yeah, I should play that. Just get it out of my hand. If I can get into Spider-Man, we've got an auto win. Uh, yeah, Death Wave kind of got... Kind of got axed by uh, Sandman. I'm going to wave. Um, wave into Galactus, I guess. What are, I can do Galactus, Doc Ock over here in Throne Room, right? Maybe we'll get lucky. I don't know. I haven't played Zoo in a long time. All right, we got Null. That's actually good. We are going to. Do I want to? Do I want to dock Ock then Galactus? This is gonna do shenanigans here, right? Do I want to dock Ock then Galactus? Oh, wait a minute. I did this wrong. Oh, my God. I'm not thinking. I thought I had... Um, oh, my God. I'm not thinking. Big dum-dum. Big dum-dum. All right. Well, we lost that one because I wasn't paying attention. Um, Let's do this because I screwed up. Let's play uh, Kang and Snap and then uh, dip out. We lost because I, I did it wrong. I, for some reason, I thought I played Electro instead of Wave, um, which doesn't make sense in my brain. I should have played Galactus. Maybe we get free cube retention here. All 
All right. Leech, amazing. All right. Well, we probably would have lost that game anyways. Oh no. Dude, King is such a good glitchy card right now. Has this happened to other people? This happens quite a bit. All right. 